This book used to belong to a Nobel laureate. He signed it on the cover and dated it, 1944. He was a professor at Harvard for a long time. After he passed away, they cleared out his office and they gave away his books. That's how I found this one. He was still a student at Harvard when he had this book. This was during World War II. The United States was building the atomic bomb and the government was recruiting young physicists. Some of the recruits ended up being Soviet spies, like Theodore Hall, another Harvard kid. But the student who owned this book wanted to help. So he left Harvard after his sophomore year and he went to the Manhattan Project in New Mexico. He was only 18. I always wondered if he took this book with him. A lot of the physicists that he met there went on to have great careers. All of the big time physicists worked on that project. Guys like Richard Feynman and Niels Bohr. After the war, he came back to Harvard, he graduated, then he got his PhD. And he ended up winning the Nobel Prize. I like that story. It makes me want to become a professor someday. I want to spend my life learning new things. Like he did. I think that would be a pretty good life.